Welcome to Inside Science TV. When an emergency strikes, they are the first to arrive. You just, you never know what you're going to get yourself into. That's why only the very best gear is critical for first responders. Fire Chief Danny Thomas says the ideal uniform would offer multiple layers of protection. Chemical resistant, fire resistant, uh, bulletproof. Now, chemical engineer Francesco Fornasiero says this fabric can repel both biological and chemical agents. It gives protection to the uh, personnel that are wearing it. The material is designed to go from a breathable state to a protective state, so it can be worn in any situation. It needs to allow you to breathe well in a way that you can be comfortable in a hot environment. In the event of a biological or chemical threat, the fabric contains pores made of tiny carbon nanotubes. They are narrow rolled up sheets of carbon that are only 50 to 1,000 atoms wide. Biological agents are bigger in size and the fabric is able to block them. Chemical agents are smaller, but the nanotubes are coated with materials that stick to the chemical agents. The fabric is designed to protect against sulfur mustard, nerve agents, and anthrax. It's a discovery that could change the game for first responders. We, we make sure that they have the latest and greatest. And one day, this could be it. I'm Josh Lebowitz reporting. Inside Science TV. If you enjoyed this edition, follow us on Facebook, Twitter, and YouTube. Powered by the American Institute of Physics and a coalition of underwriters.